Hello, Cathedral family and friends. This is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. I wanted to give you a weekly update of what's been happening at the Cathedral of Faith campus. I was walking through the massive lines that we had on our campus of people who were coming to to receive food. I mean, these are people who've lost their jobs because of the economic turndown, and they need food just to feed their families. And as I was walking through the lines of cars, a well, scripture dropped into my heart, and I, I identified with the disciples when the multitudes were over the hillsides, and Jesus told them to feed 15 or 20,000 people. And the disciples said, what are we amongst so many? And that's how I felt. And yet in that story, as they took what they had, the little boy brought what he had and they gave it into the hands of Jesus and Jesus blessed it and broke it and distributed it. And the multitudes were fed. When someone starts giving God something to work with, never underestimate what God can do. He can multiply it far beyond what you could ever ask or imagine. And that's what we've seen happen right here on the Cathedral of Faith campus, that we have been able to serve over 3,500 families in a week and news of what's been going on about God's love being shared here on campus. It's been on the Today Show nationally, and it's even gone international through the Filipino channel. So people are seeing God's love being lived out. Thank you so much, Cathedral of Faith. Way to go as we have put what we had into God's hands and we've donated our time and donated our finances, God is multiplying it and doing amazing things to meet the needs of our valley. And the same kind of thing happened through all our Easter services. What a, an unusual Easter season it's been. And yet God took what we, well, we offered what we had to God and God took it and multiplied it. And through the NBC program that was aired and through our online campus participation, by far, by far, it was our biggest Easter weekend ever. The gospel went out to more people in the Bay Area than ever went out before through our church. Way to go, Cathedral. Way to get the word out. God did amazing things through the Easter season. Continue to uh, let people know about the online campus and the NBC program. We will have a program being aired every week at that same time on Sunday morning from 9 to 10 that will go throughout the Bay Area. I know it's a very difficult time, very difficult. And you're in our prayers. We love you. and. We know for many, it's just a real time of struggle. Everybody's been impacted by this. But thank you for your faithfulness. Because of your giving, we're able to do what we're doing and stepping up as a church family to meet the needs of our community right now. So thank you more than ever. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I want to speak God's blessing on you, you know, for this day. Let hope fill your heart. You know, continue to say your prayers. Know that we will get to the other side of this. Every storm has a limited lifespan, and together we will get through this. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May His face shine brightly upon you. May the Lord be gracious to you and give you His peace in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Love you, Cathedral.